Howdy, hey guys, right here today with a special parks exclusive product review. This time it will be the special Pixar Pier themed puzzle light up set. Available at Real Disney and Shop Disney as of the recording here. Each of the three here are themed to the three billboards that you see next to Adorable Snowman M on Pixar Pier. Starting with Coco, we have the Coco billboard right here. And on each box, I'll show you how it lights up. It takes. And here's the back of it. And I think it looks like it takes AAA batteries. I'll let you guys know after I finish unboxing them. And we have the Finding Dory themed one. Probably my favorite of the three to be honest. As you can see, I'm a sucker for Gerald and Becky. And here's, oh. and here's the back side of them. They have one of the rolling case you're wondering. These are all generally the same format here, just the different design puzzles. These are really cool, and you can also mount these on the wall, which is going to be super awesome if you are a fan of the parks. Here's the Wally one. And so much for the boxes now. I'm going to open these up, build them, and I'll show you guys afterwards. So, see you in a second. So, here we have all three of the puzzles built out in full, with each of them in front of their respective box here. And going in order from left to right, we'll start off with the Wally one, probably the second most popular after Coco. Here, inspired by their electric spark kiss th scene, and also having a pretty good vista of the pier, minus any trademarks, stuff like Mickey or anything that identifies it separately from a Pixar, different Pixar movie, and such. And here's the back, all the borders and things are the same. Here. And surprisingly, I actually came with three AAAs already, so you didn't have to buy any others. And there's also a stand here. So if you want to display it back like this on the, whatever surface you want, you can too. Or you can just have it upright. There is a little bit of a slant forward. Or facing out, at least. So that way it can stand up properly by itself without the standout. And such like, just like that. And you have a little on and off switch. So let's show it right here. It's very really cute, illuminates just like it would in the park almost, but probably not exactly, although this might be brighter, in my opinion. I don't know, it's been a little while since I've seen the, the signs at night. So let me put that right over here. Just a smidge. Then moving on to the most popular one from what I've heard and seen is Coco. Very much inspired by the Prowl Corazon song from the very end of the movie. And in case you're wondering, this is how you get them in and out. You just have a little platform for the puzzle pieces to put into before you slide it in. And it has like a little bit of a barrier so you can't see the borders of that frame. And the fr edges of this frame will cover it a little so that way it doesn't fall out as easily. Which is really good. No reason to show you the back. And there's fun little details all over like Dante is there. All of Miguel's extended family seems to be showing up in this. And then with the lights on, there we have that. And then last but certainly not least, my favorite one, the Finding Dory one. Featuring our favorite seals and sea lions from that movie along with Becky, Dory, and the otters. Doing a PSA about littering. Which really wasn't talked about but hinted at in the movie a lot. Which is really cool. So you got a little door where my thumb is. Keep our pier beautiful, and so we keep, <laughs> keep our pier beautiful, so we can just keep swimming. Oh, phrase all over it. And there's a bunch of trash, cute little otters, and we also have Fluke and Rudder in the back there. Probably getting really ready to tell Gerald to get off, off. And here's it with the lights on. And super cool. Probably my favorite part. And so, yeah, there we have all three of the Pixar Pier billboard puzzles built out. This does retail for $19.99 plus tax, although there is discounts applicable if you have any, like a Legacy AP one, cast member, or, or anything of that sort. And for $20, bucks, i would say you're kind of getting away what he's worth there. Almost. I just wish it was like maybe just a little bit bigger. But these are really cool. These are going to make for really great display pieces in your new room if you're a big Pixar fan. And even it's like a nice subtle touch to the theme parks. Even if you don't have people who know what the 
reference is specifically, they'll at least appreciate that it's based off of the movies like Wally, -E, Coco, and Finding Dory. And overall, I definitely enjoy this. I'm looking forward to finding a spot in my room I can hang it, hopefully, soon. So with all that out of the way, hope you guys enjoyed this little review here. Be sure to do all the YouTube jazz, like, comment, subscribe, and all that fun stuff. Until next time, I'll see you all real soon.